Hey guys, it's Allison, and I'm about to be a freshman in college, and I'm moving in on Saturday. So I've been thinking a lot about how I'm going to continue doing music in college, and this is how I'm going to do it, and some other ways you could possibly go about continuing your music career while you're also continuing your education career. So let's go. First, I'm going to talk about how I did music in high school. Um, obviously, my personal thing is songwriting, so. Um, Throughout high school, I started learning to play piano, guitar, ukulele, um, and writing songs with those instruments. So that's kind of my main thing that I want to focus on and continue while I'm in school and for the rest of my life because it's something that's personally really important to me. It's how I deal with a lot of stress and it's also a really fun hobby and passion project sort of thing. So I'll always continue writing songs, so it's important for me to bring along some instruments with me. Also in high school I did choir and orchestra. I did orchestra through middle school and also all the way through high school and then I started choir in my junior year when I started deciding to learn to sing um, because I was doing my songwriting obviously so um, it became clear that my focus with music is a lot on my personal music, so that's why I think I'll be in less organized groups in college, so I'm probably not going to be in an orchestra, I'm probably not going to be in a choir. I don't know if choir and orchestra would take up too much time in school, so it's currently not my primary focus, so um, I don't think I will be bringing my violin along with me, which is really sad, um, because when am I going to practice it? <laughs> if I'm not in an orchestra, like, what would I play? So, um, probably not going to bring my violin along with me, which is, makes me a little sad. Um, I think I actually want to be focused a little more in the theater. So I'm going to look into getting into musical theater because um, I did it a little this summer. I was in a show and I absolutely love it. I think theater is, has, I've always loved theater and I never actually performed on stage in a musical before, and I just love it. So I want to see if I can somehow get more involved in that, and maybe try that as something new as opposed to sticking with the things that I did in high school, which are orchestra, choir, and then in high school I also did stage crew for musicals, so I think by going into acting that could get me something new to try. and get to love while I'm in school, because when you're in college you don't necessarily want to do the same activities you did in high school. You might want to look into them, but you want to change up your interests a little bit and see if there's something new you can discover about yourself that you really like, or something new to pursue that you found out you actually love. So, <laughs> so for college specifically, I bought the Akai MPK Mini, which I will show to you right now. I've opened it already, I just set it back in the box. But, um. Okay. Um. So, for college, I bought this little keyboard, which I've been wanting a mini keyboard for a while that I could easily just plug into my laptop and just record straight on rather than having sound come out through a speaker trying to record. So, this, you just plug it on in and then you attach this to your laptop and then you pull out the program or whatever you're using. I personally use GarageBand at this moment because I'm just starting out and trying to figure things out. But um, this has got like drum pad controls and then it's got, I believe, 25 keys. Um, what's great about this is it's so, so small and so you can just put it in a box and pull it out and it doesn't take up a lot of space in your tiny tiny dorm room and you will always have this on hand you can keep it even on your desk it would probably fit it's about the size of a laptop width wise and then like this way it's much smaller and then the keys are small but you can still play them pretty easily if you're writing melodies or doing chords and then you also have these drum pads so that I can start exploring music production a little bit and see what I like in that area when I'm writing my songs. 
The other thing that I debated about when I was deciding what instruments to bring, um, I first of all, I wasn't originally going to bring, bring a keyboard until I decided to buy that MIDI keyboard. Um, the other thing was, am I going to bring my ukulele or am I going to bring my guitar? It was going to be one or the other. Um, I definitely wanted one of them, but the pros with bringing my ukulele is it's small and it's easy to play. It's just always there. It takes up very little room. And then the pros with my guitar were um, I tend to write more things on my guitar and um, I tend to prefer it because of the sound, uh, the versatility of it. I feel like I can use it more often and honestly I do use my guitar most of the time for songwriting and just playing music in general. So I did indeed decide that I was going to bring my guitar. So um, I'm going to take it in a gig bag, I'm going to put it wherever it fits, um, and it's going to sit in my dorm room and I'm going to play it and hopefully it works out and I can have time to play it and write with it and have it not take up too much space. And if not, I'll just take it back home. But I really hope I get a chance to use it. I'm definitely always going to have the MIDI keyboard because I feel like it's so small and easy to use. And I'm actually really excited to start using that. I'm so glad I got it. Um, it was just 100 bucks on Amazon. So if you're going to college and you play any instrument at all, I recommend the MIDI keyboard. It's I feel like it was a smart decision for me and any college musician who wants to continue doing what they're doing while in the dorm life. Um, in terms of when I think I'm going to be able to play my instruments at home, and by at home I mean in my dorm, um, whenever <laughs> my roommate's not there, um, probably at night when like things are still kind of noisy and I'm not bugging people. Um, I'm just going to find whatever time I can to work on my music. Um, I'm probably going to write song lyrics a lot during the day, when I normally do at night, um, and just try to figure out how to continue my songwriting life while in college. So I'm bringing my mini keyboard, I'm bringing my guitar, and I'm looking into going into musical theater and seeing what I have time to do basically in college. So if you want to know more in terms of updates about my music life in college, subscribe to this channel. I'm going to hopefully continue making videos and I will see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.